FCT Minister Mohammed Musa Bello told the visiting delegation that traffic laws specify that articulated vehicles are restricted from plying routes in the mornings and early evenings, which he described as a measure to safeguard lives and property of residents. He commended Nupeng for his contribution to the nation's economy, especially in the area of job creation, assuring that plans are on the way to establish a truck yard to serve as a transit park for tankers. We are now in the process of developing what is already in the master plan, uh, development of a unique location that will cater for as a depot, as a transit location for haulage vehicles, including those hauling petroleum products. The Nupeng president and his counterpart, National Chairman Petroleum Tanker Drivers Association, pledged to collaborate with the FCT administration in the developmental strife of making Abuja a dream city. Federal capital territory, you know, is a city where everybody, you know, want to take part, or to be part of, you know, the, the, the structuring development that is going on here. And uh, our tanker driver branch of Nupeng, you know, decided to come up with such efforts you know, to acquire land, you know, to build some projects, including even estates, you know, for their team in membership. Government cannot do everything alone. We, as a good Nigeria, we ourselves, we need to develop. They, however, promise to abide with the road traffic laws for the benefit of all. Shuaibu Onoze Akubu, NTA News.